Africa. Today I'm at Mfumbwe Beach at Jambiani in Zanzibar. Yes, it's the island that is definitely very popular for its spices production and also the mysterious and magnificent architecture. But guess what? Today I'm not here for any of that. Today I'm here because it's Zanzibar's first beach water sports festival. And behind me is the set. And it's definitely ready. Yeah, actually we stay living in Chambiane, more in the north part, and because of the festival we are Assalamu alaikum! Wa alaikum salam! Assalamu alaikum! Wa alaikum salam! A special greeting from Zanzibarian people to everyone who's watching Zibana right now. An original festival is not just music, it's not about movies, it's about beach life, beach culture, water sports, and a bit of music. Ladies and gentlemen, and this is how we kick off at Zanzibar's first ever Beach Water Sports Festival. Dabo, pira kuko shok faham, kuna kase hemo yo abo, channel 5 yo manango hai na chenga. Party Rock! Yeah! the host of a number of festivals including the Saudi Zabustara Music Festival and the Zanzibar International Film Festival. To add up to the list is the one that we're celebrating today. I guess by now you should be, you should put this down on your calendar for next year. With a little bit of an African flavor, some West African Kuduro, a little bit of hip-hop, blending it up with music from around the world, keeping it positive with a touch of reggae, fitting the scenery. That is the Beach Water Sports Festival, which continues in flourishing the already developed tourism industry in Zanzibar. when it comes to a sports activity or day in a beach that like day. Well, the first one is, of course, some sexy beach outfit. Oh, well, actually, there's no secrets. It's just, uh, you know, finding the most comfortable clothes and just wear them, right? I guess that's the secret. Okay, for ladies, it's perhaps a little bit much more complicated. We all know how you ladies are. Marilyn, for you, how much does a beach wear really mean to you? No, it's just to be casual on one side and fashionable on the other side. So you want to show up on one side, but on the other side it should be like, you know, you should be feel comfortable in what you're wearing. And of course the shades. Real. We're talking from the UV rays and the hats. A good camera, a very good camera, is also very essential. The way they turn, pull up on a big Another fantastic thing about the Beach Water Sports Festival here at Panjani Beach in Zanzibar is the cultural infusion. Well, I'm talking about the infusion between the tourists from abroad and the local people. Why they, why they bring their bikinis, their hot bodies, sunglasses, UV rays, and whatever you may think of. We've got the Maasai Jump here happening. One of the most popular Tanzanian cultures ever. So what is happening here basically is the Maasai hair jump. So let's get ourselves busy. This is the re remix. Two sides to every story. Our competition is about to begin.
around for in the evening here at Mfumbi Beach in Zanzibar and I'm having such a fabulous time, I'm telling you. Since we've reached here, there's been lots of excitement, lots of creative things happening. And again, I, I'll say, I said this before and I'll say it again, what I love the most is the fusion of the two cultures, uh, of the different cultures from the tourists and the locals all together. It, it's, it's so much really, uh, so many things happening. But standing next to here at the bar, like chilling, we like, we like, we like the cool guys chilling by the bar. It's not other than Victor. Victor, how you doing? I'm good, how are you? Fine. Victor, you, 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 you're one of our hosts here and, and we just want to say a Santa Santa for everything you've done so far. But, I'm a little bit curious, are you happy with everything that you've seen so far? Yeah, pretty pleased with everything. Everything's gone as planned. Uh, we're still, like you say, it's only 4pm right now, so the event is going on till uh, around 1am. And then tomorrow it continues again till 1am the next day. So, so far, very pleased with everything. Everything has gone as planned and we're happy. As I told you earlier, one of the essential items that you need on a festival, a beach festival like this, is of course a good camera. I'm talking about a really, really good brother here who definitely defines what a good camera is. Hi! Focus. What's your name? My name is Robin. You got a really nice camera. Yeah, this is uh, this is my profession actually. Focus. Tell me about this picture. Well, they are just coming up the rest of us. Like they have to come out. I'm totally sure that you already are enjoying yourself the magnificent view of Mfumbwe Beach at Jambiani in Zanzibar. Yes, that's right. But just before the sun goes down and we get ourselves ready for the party, there's one more important person that we have to talk to. You know, this is the director of, uh, of, the, of the festival, of the, of the Beach and Water Sports Festival, and of course the director, the managing director of Coral Rock Hotel. Mr. Neil, how are you doing? Uh, good, thanks yourself. Neil, you've been our host, and, 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 and we've had such a marvelous time, and we're actually looking forward to more great time. Tell me, do you, do, do, you, do, do you see this festival happening in the next five years, and how do you see it? Uh, yeah, we wanted to add a, a new festival to the Zanzibar calendar. Uh, we want to do this every year and we want to see it growing in numbers and volumes. Um, and it's an original festival, it's not just music, it's not about movies, it's about beach life, beach culture, water sports and a bit of music in it. Oh, in big of music, you're a DJ. That's right. Famously known as DJ Riznatch, correct? Riznatch. <laughs> Riznatch, tell me what's in your playlist today. Um, I'm going with a little bit of an African flavor, some West African Kuduro, a little bit of hip hop, blending it up with music from around the world, keeping it positive, with a touch of reggae, fitting the scenery. Oh no, now that's a killer DJ talking there. What's your favorite among all of those genres you've talked about? Uh, right now my favorite is Kuduro. I believe that's the Kuduro, future that's, of African that, that's dance from music. West Africa. It's Angola and Portugal, so mm -hmm. combination, a little bit of UK dub in there. Mm -hmm. Why Kuduro? Because cause, cause you, you, you're, not, you're not originally African. How long have you, have, have, have you spent time in, in Africa? For you to get um, actually, I've been, to, I've been in Africa yeah. my whole life and uh, I like tribal rhythms. I like a lot of real percussion oh. and some thumping bass. Oh. 